ma'am, you sneezed in your hand and you're touching people. Just because we're in the sanctuary, just because it's Sunday and we're in service doesn't make those germs sanctified, okay? <laughs> you still sneezed in your hand. It's your girl Anitra here and I am back with another vlog. Okay, I keep trying to tell y'all I'm trying to get into this vlog life. But every time I do stuff that I like to do or that I find interesting, um, I never pick up the camera. Um, listen, I think about picking up the camera, but I'm just like, Ugh. but I figured today would be a great day to take you guys along. Um, I have to run a few errands today and let's see what else do I have to do. I have to do some cleaning, but I'm not going to vlog that. And then I have my nephew's birthday party later on today. I'm not going to vlog that either, but I figure the errands, y'all, y'all will enjoy the errands today. So I'm going to do one of, you know, my favorite Saturday morning activities, and that is going to stores touching clothes and stay oh that's cute that that's cute right there you know uh sniff a couple candles look at some home decor uh grab some iced coffee and then come back home and do a few other things before i have to get to this birthday party y'all so let me just give you a quick sneak peek at today's ootd and then we're going to head on out all right, y'all, so I figured I'd give you a quick sneak peek at my OOTD before I head out the door. So today is very much a comfy, chic day. So I have on a long cardigan and I have on my favorite graphic tee ever, my Moesha graphic tee. Listen, Moesha Ahakim all day. This was my favorite t uh, show as a teen because listen, Moesha was my life. <laughs> Okay, Moesha, Moesha, Moesha. So I love this tee. I have it paired with some black joggers. And I don't care what people say. These are not uh, Crocs. They are clogs. These are my Adidas clogs. And um, as I'm standing here looking at it, y'all, I'm second guessing these socks. Um, but as you can see, I have on a long cardigan. And then I am carrying the bag of the day, which is uh, my Kurt Geiger drench bag. And like I said, now that I'm standing here, y'all looking at this in the mirror, I'm second guessing these socks. So I'm thinking I'm going to change into my Kisses socks. So another quick peek at today's OOTD. So there you have it. All right, y'all. So y'all know, I, I, I can tell that y'all see pardon the dust, pardon all the stuff that's going on in the background, um, in the process of like reorganizing literally everything. So there's a lot going on in this space. I just shot a video last night, another unboxing video that will be dropping before this video drops. So yes, so you know, Saturdays are for cleaning and, you know, running errands, aka going to all the home decor stores sniffing candles and then you know touching clothes and window shopping and coming back home you know feeling revived and refreshed okay so let me head out now and um run these errands before you know the stores get a little too peopley and and that makes my nerves bad so let's head out y'all <laughs>
right y'all so i am back home um so many things happened y'all while i was out and about today <sighs> you saw a few of the things i picked up in the store that tickled my fancy but i figured why not do a haul and show you guys you know what i actually came home with so let's get right into that shall we all right, so let me start off by asking you guys because maybe it's just me, okay? But you know, Starbucks apparently is all the rage. I am a Dunkin' girl myself. Anitra runs on Dunkin'. However, I was just like, you know what? I'm in Target. Let me just try Starbucks iced coffee for the first time. I've had the green tea. It's amazing. But I said, you know what? Let me try the iced coffee today, y'all. So I got a uh, iced coffee with pumpkin spice cold foam and uh, stevia. And this, I don't know y'all, it just didn't give what it was supposed to give. I feel like my homemade iced coffee was better. Um, I don't know, let me know, you know, what should I order from Starbucks because this just wasn't it. And if this is what Starbucks has to offer and this is all hype, let me know and I'll just stick with my Dunkin' y'all. But this just didn't give what it was supposed to give. But we're going to get into our Target haul first. And so I have this Neutrogena Hydro Boost Hydrating a uh, mask here i can't wait to try this um i have been switching up my skincare routine um yeah so i'll sh probably share more about this experience um in a different video i also have the hydro boost exfoliating cleanser here um, i'm adding this to my collection of the neutrogena hydro boost a line i have a few other products that i've been trying and i have been loving but if you are interested in hearing my opinion on these products let me know in the comments below <sighs> we have some wet ones we all know why we need those i found this cute little eos lip balm and this is a watermelon frosé i was just here for the packaging we have a Tide to go pin. Definitely using another one of those. We have some up and up uh, exfoliating cotton rounds. Now I've been looking forward to trying these. Uh, and again, these will probably, I'll probably do a review on these when I do, if I do a, a skincare video. Let's see. I also saw these cute little socks. And they are by the Exhilaration brand. Now, I really feel like these are gummy bears. <laughs> and I just think that they were just like so adorable. And listen, who could pass up a good black and white striped sock situation? I also found these cute little earrings by A New Day. Y'all, I, I, I think I like gold. I don't know, y'all tell me. What am I wearing today? I have on gold earrings today. Listen, I, I think I like gold, y'all. I think I like gold. All right, so we have that. Also from Target, we have, listen, y'all, pumpkin spice coffee. Again, like I said, Anitra runs on Dunkin'. I'm team Dunkin' all day. These were on sale, y'all. The coffee at Target is $9.39. These were on sale for $6.57, you know, because pumpkin spice season, they feel like it has, you know, a time frame. I can drink pumpkin spice all year if they just stop taking away the option. But I re-upped on my pumpkin spice iced coffee. I also uh, got this sugar-free French vanilla Tarani coffee syrup and some gum i don't know why it's been so hard for me to find uh my favorite brand of gum lately but that is target okay now let's get into the tj maxx stuff which is actually the reason why i went to the shopping center i had to pick up an online order y'all i went in tj maxx got distracted, started picking up random stuff and got to check out and 
thankfully the Lord reminded me, you came up here to pick up an order. <laughs> And I was like, oh, you know what? I almost forgot my order. And I didn't even have to get out of line or anything like that. The Sorry, y'all, my camera cut off. But as I was saying, yeah, so it was nice. The lady, she just grabbed my order and let me uh, pretty much do everything in one uh, fell scoop instead of, you know, being mean and making me get back in line. So that was cool. Um, Yeah, so let me show you guys what I got from TJ Maxx. Listen, y'all, the selection today at Target and TJ Maxx was just so underwhelming, y'all. Like, I got as much footage as I possibly could. Plus, the music was blessed, and I might have to put music over all the clips. But it is what it is. But, so first off, we got these placements. And this is set of six, and it's by Lumi. Y'all, these are so pretty. I can't wait to use these um, for my uh, winter slash Christmas tablescape idea. Super excited. Just look at how they glisten, y'all. I know a lot of people are over the glam and everybody's into like that restoration hardware. Everything is black, white, and wood or, you know, just uh, what's it called? Um, my, it's like a... Uh, it, I'm drawing a blank, y'all. I'm drawing a blank. It'll come to me randomly. Um, listen, I've been on a coffee syrup kick, y'all. And so we have my uh, skinny syrup here in vanilla almond. Listen, we also have another coffee syrup. <clears throat> and we have sugar cookie, which will be perfect for the holiday season since people want to hurry up and cancel pumpkin spice. Now this was a random, but I was just like, I want to try it. And that is these uh, mango habanero uh, kettle chips. And I was just like, let me try them and see what they taste like. Now I tell you, like I said, this is very random, very random. Make sure you check out my uh, short that I post. <laughs> And that literally explains my shopping trip. So I found some uh, press-ons and I have finally found some almond shaped press-ons because that's, that's my jam. My nails have been going through it y'all. They all decided to break at one time. So a sister needs something. And so I feel like these little press-ons are too cute. We have some pretty in pink and we have born to be nude. And that's pretty much my wheelhouse when it comes to nails. Um, I need a, a good, good nude, y'all. <laughs> okay, now let, let's let's discuss this item here, y'all. Let's let's talk about this item here, okay? This, what do we call this? This, let's see, this is fifty nine point two ounces of just pumpkin spice syrup, y'all. Okay sugar-free all of the syrups that i've purchased today are sugar-free um jordan's yeah the jordan skinny syrups brand i just chef's kiss i love them but y'all i'm not listen i needed something to go with the coffee i got from target and this listen perfect for me perfect for me okay don't don't judge don't laugh you know you wish you had a jug of pumpkin spice too all right, y'all, but let me show you the item that I actually went to TJ Maxx to pick up. All right, so here we have it here. Now, y'all, let me just say that when I found this item online, I have been wanting this item for a long, long time. And I was super duper excited when I realized that TJ Maxx had it on their website. And we're just gonna open up the packaging here. And let me see which way is it facing all right y'all look take a look it's in our book okay i am so excited that i finally got my book now i can restyle or begin restyling my uh bookshelf um that you guys typically see in the background when i film videos but I was super excited to find this. I cannot wait to open it. Y'all, 
I got this book for 60, I'll put the price somewhere on the screen. Um, and if what I'll do as well is I'll put the link to the book in the description as well. But yo, I was so excited because typically, as you guys know, people, most uh, stores have it for 79, 89, sometimes more than that. But to find this book for less than $65, I was so excited and shipping is free if you get it shipped to the store, which is, listen, here for it. Yo, thank you for hanging out with me today. Um, make sure you click that like button, click the subscribe button, click that notification bell so you can stay tuned for all things faith and fashion on this channel. I have a couple videos coming soon yes all right y'all it's sunday morning i said before i head out i give you guys a quick ootd so we have a lime green blazer i literally just got it it's supposed to be part of a haul video coming soon we have a graphic tee some jeans some ankle booties and i am still carrying my drench bag and so we're about to head on out to service i'll talk to y'all later Hey y'all, so before I close out the vlog, I just wanted to talk to y'all um, about something that just happened to me at church. So just got home from church, you know, enjoyed the service um, and everything that it entailed. And listen, y'all, I just feel like, you know, it's time for preachers, pastors to rethink the whole tell your neighbor, touch your neighbor, slap your neighbor, push your neighbor, you know, knock your neighbor out the seat. So this morning, you know, once again, enjoying the praise and worship. And this lady, I'm sitting on the end, the lady that wants to get in the row, she pokes me to get my attention. All right, <laughs> sign number one, I let that slide. Now, you know, because we're still, even though people act like it's not a thing anymore, it's still very much a thing. Um, you know, we practice social distancing. So, you know, we sit really close to the people that you came with, <laughs> that you came with. Um, and, you know, we're still wearing masks during service. Me and this lady did not come together, y'all. However, she proceeds to sit very close to me. So you poked me and now you're in my space. Fine. Okay. That's quite all right. Mind you, the service is this way, but she, everything is happening this way, y'all. I'm sitting here, but she's constantly looking to see what I'm doing. Okay. All right. I see how this is going to go. You know what? Cool, cool, cool. So, um, the lady sneezed during service. There was no into the elbow. There was no hand sanitizer, y'all. There was no tissue, no wet ones, Clorox wipes, Lysol, nothing. This is the hand that she wanted to worship with. <laughs> y'all, the, the rest of the service. That was her worship hand, the sneeze hand. Mind you, I'm here, my purse, her. But she's so close that her hand is waving. <laughs> the sneeze hand is in my vicinity. <sighs> Y'all, then the pastor goes to say, look at your neighbor and say X, Y, and Z. However, no, because she's proven to be touchy-feely for no reason in the earlier part of the service. Not only was it a look, it was also a touch. Y'all guess which hand, <laughs> guess which hand she wanted to use <laughs> in fellowship on my arm, y'all. <laughs> the sneeze hand, okay? Fine. <laughs> it's not fine, but I'm trying, listen, I feel like your Jesus is tested at times. <laughs> and my Jesus was so tested because... You know, the pastor geared up again with a, this time it was a for real touch your neighbor, y'all. And, you know, she went to reach that hand. <laughs> she went to reach for that hand, y'all. And I had already positioned myself to where I wasn't even really 
in the vein of being able to see what she was doing anymore um, or to give any social cues that could be misread and said that I was still down for this sneeze hand interaction. So fine, we, you know, there was no more touching for the remainder of the sermon. However, after the benediction, not only does she come in with the sneeze hand, y'all, she comes in with the other hand like this. She comes in like this, y'all, and puts both hands on me to tell me to have a great week. As if there was, ma'am, you could have said that. You Again, we didn't come together. You don't know me, but you came in like this to touch. You know your hand is still got sneeze germs on it. Your, it why are you reaching out to touch? Oh, <sighs> y'all. Listen, why, why, why? And you know what? I just, and, and uh, y'all, the way she went in, it was like, it was like, I wasn't being friendly. Like I wasn't being welcoming. Ma'am, you sneezed in your hand and you're touching people. Just because we're in the sanctuary, just because it's Sunday and we in service doesn't make those germs sanctified. Okay, <laughs> you still sneeze in your hand. Again, no sanitizer, no tissues, no Clorox wipes, bleach, nothing. Touch this hand. You sneezed and proceeded to wave. Okay. Anyway, enough with my Sunday rants. Okay, so I showed you guys um, the book that I ordered from. Um, TJ Maxx that came and then later on yesterday uh, the rest of the books that I've ordered for um, revamping my uh, bookshelf came as well but before I show you that let me show you these cute little glasses that I found by Smith and Gold that I found at Burlington Coat Factory. Y'all, I have been looking for these for some time and they had several different uh, styles to select from. I love cat eye glasses, so I went with the cat eyes. Um, but the thing is y'all, I do have some silver accents in my uh, on my bookshelf, but I really, really wish that I could find these in white. And so I'm gonna, even though I found these, I'm gonna keep looking um, to see if I can find some in white. And I'm not one of those people who buy, unless it's thrifted, I'm not one of them people who buy something like brand new from the store and gets excited about spray painting it. If I bought it from the store, it, it has to be something that I like, not something that I have plans of changing. Again, unless I got it from the thrift store. So that's that, got these glasses. Now I got this, uh, and you know what? I'm sitting here talking about, you know, I really wish it was all white, but I bought this uh, Bible, y'all. Um, it's King James, the thou thus this, okay? Um, and, you know, I guess I can just tie in more silver because the Bible is definitely white and silver. And so bought this for my bookshelf as well. We also have, listen, two other books that I have been, you know, I added them to cart, take them out of cart, add them to cart, take them out of cart, but I finally bought them. And that is my forever first lady and my forever president, Michelle and Barack, Barack and Michelle Obama. Um, yeah, so I purchased their books. They are gonna be added to my bookshelf as well. Super excited to style it up and, um, you know, you guys will be able to see it in the background of more videos once everything is put together but y'all that closes out this weekend vlog let me know if you want to see more vlogs on my channel y'all this the making vlogs to me is actually more fun than making sit down videos um just because of all the preparation that goes into making sit down videos it's a whole production y'all whereas you can just pick up the camera um, for vlogging and just, you know, let people see what you see as you go, you know, about your day. But this has been enjoyable. Uh, yeah, I am sleepy. I am looking forward to taking off this outfit, getting in my good Sunday afternoon nap, y'all. Um, I have a turkey burger, a lettuce wrap turkey burger that I'm getting ready to enjoy, y'all. And I'm going to get in my good old 
Sunday afternoon after service nap. Oh boy. Listen, you, oh man. This, it's just something about those Sunday afternoon naps, y'all, that just do my heart. So good, y'all. Um, yes. And so, yeah, so that concludes today's vlog. Again, my name is Anitra. We're different by design. We're Faith and Fashion Connect. And you have a great day.